Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Medieval Dynasty. So we have some stuff that we need to do today. Um, we have some bowls and stuff for food, but I also wanted to keep an eye on the wood supply. We're in the middle of a storm right now, so I wanted to see how much wood we're actually going through and if it's going to make it any different. It doesn't look like it's dropped too much actually, so it might be just about, about the right uh, production. We do have some extra daub though, so we might as well go ahead and um, start working on one of these buildings. I can't remember which one that I started working on. I think it might have been this one. So we'll start working on that. And uh, another thing that we have uh, set up here, this is built into the storage. But um, logs actually work perfectly, like they literally align up perfectly for this uh, system here. So if we ever have too many logs or whatever, we can always put it into the uh, resource part right here. I'm not sure if there's any other areas we can u utilize for storage, but um, you know, baskets and stuff could probably go back here or uh, over in this area or even in this area so we can use baskets and stuff as well but this is a nice little feature built into the um, the actual resource res resource shed itself it's great for logs and planks and stuff like that so just something I, I managed to figure out over time so so that's all the daub that we have at the moment. That's all right though. We got quite a bit done for that. Um, let's see here. Let's. I just want to make sure. Oh, we've actually gone up a little bit, haven't we? Uh, firewood 117. It was at 114 just a second ago. So uh, it looks like we do have enough to make uh, some fur shoes as well. So we'll see if we can't get some of those uh, made up. I'm going to. Yeah, um, we're, we have a lot of stuff on us right now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some of the stuff in here, uh, put some of these things away, uh, we have 200 and something sticks we don't need in our inventory, um, let's see, uh, iron knife, you know, we, we don't really need that knife, but if we go hunting or whatever, we can always use it, so we might go hunting as well, uh, I always like to keep the better tools in our, in, in our, Part here so we have extra stuff and it looks like I got some potions as well so I can put those in the potion uh, thing here I'll just drop them and place them in single handedly so oh we have two of them two of those ones so we can just do that <laughs>
Alright, so I cooked some food up uh, for the villagers. I think they might be... Are they? No, they're still working. So let's just check up on their um, tools and stuff. It looks like there's still four there. Might be needing some knives. He's always around here. I've only caught him out hunting a couple times. Usually when I go hunting, oddly enough. Uh, so we got three knives. We could probably make up two more of those. Uh, let's go over to the shed over here. We should actually get some more clay while it's still out. Um, let's see. We got shovels, four shovels, and we could use one pickaxe. So two knives, one pickaxe, and two axes. So craft those up right now and then we can maybe get an extra shovel so we can or we might actually have a shovel I don't know uh, let's go ahead and grab a couple of these uh, logs we'll need those for pickaxe uh, we'll need sticks wouldn't mind crafting up a few more baskets as well uh, we don't need that at the moment but we do need stones so we'll grab a bunch of that so two knives let's see if I can remember everything uh, one pickaxe and two axes. We might need to check to see if we have a shovel or not. Uh, two axes. And one pickaxe. And we might need a shovel. Can't remember if we have one in there or not in our storage. We'll check it out, see if we do. And uh, yeah, so the next, I'm just basically for the settlement, what I'm currently trying to get sorted out is um, try to get um, somebody filled in that can work in the sewing place. Uh, we desperately need somebody in there, but every village that I've gone to in the last couple seasons, nobody's been uh, able to um, have a good enough uh, actual skill level to, that I want to put them in there so I'm just kind of waiting for them to update I'm hoping that spring it will update but um, we'll see uh, we might go hunting those crows today as well I want to sell some of the meat as well because we, we got a whole bunch of excess meat and um, need to really actually get rid of it so so we'll put this in here, and then we can put those other knives in.
great. So the plan is I want to go up to uh, this town right here because we haven't been to it yet. And um, there might be somebody there that could potentially be on our team. So, well, not team, but, you know, like the... Uh, um, yeah, recruit for working in the thing. So I want to grab what I can for weapons and stuff just in case there's any bandits. I'm going to put away some of the stuff that we don't need. So like the hammer, the shovel. Uh, we can put away the... I'm going to probably put away the bow for the time being as well. Uh, we will end up grabbing our better bow just in case there's bandits. Because I do know that there is at least one route along there that hasn't been cleared out yet. So put that there and then we'll put our axe on the second slot. And uh, as far as food and stuff, uh, we got a little bit of food, but uh, we could always use more. Um, I'm just going to put the meat here for now. And I, got, I did get some feathers and stuff, so we'll put those away before we head on out. And uh, I, I think it'll be a pretty good safe journey for the most part, but put the fur in here for now. And we'll put the feathers in here. We have 262, so we can get like 162 of those sold um, the next time we go shopping. But yeah, let's uh, head on out that way. It's not too much of a journey. We've gone farther, so... Uh, maybe there will be some carts or something along the way that we can check out. I am going to get a quick drink, though. Just so we have that all uh, full when we're traveling. But yeah, it might be a good thing. The weather's perfectly fine. I was hoping that it would be, so... We'll check out things, see how things are going. I uh, already checked in with our wife, and it sounds like the village is going well, running smoothly, so I'm not too worried about taking this little journey out there at the moment. But we'll see if we can't find anything along the way as we're heading out this direction. It's a pretty safe route outside of that one bandit location, so if we have to go around it, then we will.
All right, so another storm's coming in. Uh, just started like a second ago as everyone got to work. You hardly can see across the river there. Um, I did get somebody for the sewing hut, as you can... Well, you can't really see because I have the UI disabled, but she's here working at the thing. She'll make uh, two boots per day. Uh, same rough amount that we're getting from the hunting lodge. She does have some stuff in the um, her thing. Um, as far as her skill level, it's not that great, but it's still something. I'm sure she'll progress a little bit more. It's only two at the moment, but, um, you know, it, it will be what uh, she can do at the moment, and then she, it'll get better over time uh, as she levels up in that particular skill. I also crafted a bunch of baskets up, and then I sorted some of the stuff. So we have the raw ores, um, smelted ores, we have the logs there, feathers, some of those things, sticks that aren't actually fitting in the basket. I couldn't fit that in the basket, the uh, straw. We have the daub, we have some stone, and tons of other bucket or baskets that we can actually utilize for other resources that we collect. So, a little bit more organized. I also got, um, I almost forgot that we had um, a whole bunch of rot that we needed to turn into fertilizer. So she's, uh, our wife's basically working on getting that at the moment and I started working on the last few berries that we had were turning into more rot so we should have it ready for next season definitely I wouldn't mind actually placing down some more flowers along the sides here I think that would look really good uh, for the barn and we might even if you put some around here as well there's not too much foliage in around this area so we might be able to be able to do that anyhow if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out